if you cheated and you are sent back, you are very foolish. Nobody is ever sorry. Who take the girl that has, has a body count of 10? How many is a body count? See. Okay, like man, Abi. Go and help. Exactly. I, 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 want to see, I, I want to understand that. Yeah, Never yeah, in yeah. your life you don't flex. Like, lie that you don't flex. I don't. Don't. Mm -mm. Life is boring. Guy, how will you Come here, God, 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 God. A girl has a whole lot of body count. Mm. She is freaking cheap. My body count is so much that I can't remember. And I can say it anywhere, even in front of my friends. You know what? I'm a man. Yeah. Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you get Naya Ovele, that's for the first time. Hi, my loves. My name is Naya. I'm a Lagos based YouTuber. Currently in Ogo State for school. Please don't miss the channel. Make sure you subscribe, like, subscribe, comment down below. Enjoy the nice video for you to see. I'm, I'm sure, I'm sure you will love it here. And if I turn the subscriber, hi my love, hi my baby boy, my baby girl, welcome back to the channel. Today, guys, I'm sure you guys will be surprised. The first man ever to be on my channel. Get up for him, guys. <laughs> Noisy, noisy, noisy. <laughs> finally, finally, brought a guy to my channel. I'll just actually be like the first guy to come on my channel will either be my husband or but Wait, no, if he happen, if he happen, don't worry, calm I down. Not for don't be scared. But then let's just say we shall have a first man on the channel, guys. <sighs> so um those are the honors of introducing yourself. Hi, my name is Shegun Gule Agbalan Jacobs. AKA AKA the body great. <laughs> Aka mm -hmm. fashion police. Mm -hmm. Aka since mm -hmm. morning. Oh. Aka <laughs> greatest man that ever lived. <laughs> you know, you just know, you know, you so know. So many Aka's, Aka's, Aka's. So guys, let me just give you a brief story of how this man came to sit down here. Mm. Apparently, this will be like the first male contact I'm getting outside my house apartment. We met on the podcast that you guys will soon be hearing, and I just like the fact that it was real. Most people don't want to say what's on their mind because they're like, I don't want to be pessimistic, certain kind of way. And mm -hmm. he just kept talking. He kept talking like I'm talking, <laughs> and that's on the period. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, I'm, I'm going to bring this guy to my channel. I just knew where I was going to do it, but I wasn't sure he would want to do it. But and then I asked, and then he said, No problem. Came away from Lagos, just shit, shit, God. You yeah. feel honored. I am, I am. Yeah, it should be honored. <laughs> I am honored though. We, I, I put out a tag on my WhatsApp and I think my IG and I told some girls to tell me questions they are scared of asking guys. And I brought him here to tell us the truth because <sighs> guy does not know how to filter things. You say the way it is. Okay. So without no more further ado, if you want to watch this video and have fun, this is a fun video. Make sure you keep on watching. Welcome back here. Yeah? Get your popcorn, get your drink, get your juice, whatever the case might be. Get your alcohol, whatever, and sit back and relax while you get the undiluted truth. Undiluted truth. Yeah. So the first question I would ask, I won't be telling you the people that ask the question. I, I, don't, I don't even need to know. <laughs> but the first question is, is it true that when a guy says, I am not ready for a relationship, he's not just into you? Well, well, <laughs> well. <laughs> Actually, it's not true. It is not true in any way. Okay. Tell me. I might not be ready for a relationship. See, there are a lot of things that make people ready for a relationship and not ready for a relationship. One, financially, mm -hmm. emotionally. Mm -hmm. And the fact that I still want to flex, I might still just want to have fun. So, mm -hmm. I, if you want to be in a committed relationship with someone, you should, it is possible for you not to be ready to be in a relationship. And sometimes it might just be true. So there is no definite answer for that. It can be an escape route, and can also be true that yeah, I'm not ready for a relationship. Because okay, I like you, but I want to have fun. The other girls on my mm -hmm. on my radar that I want to chop. To chop. Okay. So I don't want to break your heart. So calm down, just chill, chill. Let's still be cool, but chill. Let, let mm. me let me let me explore first. You mm. get that vibe, and I might just give you that vibe because. Probably I see I think you're a good girl, you're a sweet girl. I don't want to break your heart. Okay. And I have and I have I've put you on that cruise. So I'll just like it's not like I don't like you. I'm, I'm just, just ready. ready. You get. Oh wow. So there's no definite answer for that. 
But I feel like just a fit. But, but I feel like if you like something, like if you want money, you know you want money, you're going for money. Okay. That's the same way she'd be like, I want this girl, I'm going for her. I don't care if I'm ready or not. This is the girl. Like, I want. If you want the girl, eh? Now it is it will be very selfish of you to want someone. Oh, I won't say selfish, I'll say if you want someone, someone like me. If I want you, I want you with that. But does not mean I won't cheat. But now some boys might never want to cheat. So they will tell you, calm down. Let me explore the explore that I want mm -hmm. to explore. You get so it's not de there's no definite answer to that question. That question is mm. just have faith. Believe in yourself. Believe you are loved. Fear men. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. Fear, fear men. Yes. Hello. Stay wicked and fear men. You get that? Fear men. <laughs> no. <laughs> All right. So the next question. If you ask a girl out, out and she answers immediately, is she cheap? No. So that this question, I actually told you that this is the answer. I feel like no. no. <laughs> oh, for, oh, for five, oh no. <laughs> Come on, if you would take time, I believe then uh, Benny, I'm stressing myself. I don't stress. Personally, I don't stress. So if I ask you out, I don't accept. That's the end. That is all gone. I do, I believe, you know, catch my trips and there's no, there's no, there's no reason for sense. Why should I, why should I be the one to, yeah. to convince you that I'm worth it? Or then you should see that I'm worth it from the beginning. So if you don't, if you don't like me from the beginning, fuck off. Hello, 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 hello. Okay, okay. But me personally, I feel like every girl knows already which she wants. Yeah, exactly from there's the beginning. No for you to... Most people make their decisions from. There's what I, I read, but I don't know how true it is because I'm not a psychologist. But areas according to psychology, if you like someone. The first three seconds you already you already analyze if you date the person if mm -hmm. you can marry the person if you'll be friends with the person you already know from three seconds after meeting the person so come on if i ask you out and i won't just ask you out just there i meet you or definitely deal with that being some mm -hmm. process and i ask you out I, and you know and you you give me you are trying to i know that you don't like me but but when they, I got, you are cheap. personally if i if, if i tell you i'm trying to think about it but personally me it's just that I'm trying to weigh. Do I really like you so much to the point where I want to date you? Actually, if you tell me you are thinking about it, I believe when someone tells me I'm thinking about it, I try to notice if there are other men in her life. Okay. If there are other men in her life, I I believe there's someone else that she sees as a better option, and she's probably waiting for that person, person. to to Ooh. shoot a shot. Okay, but if if i okay if there are new ways that i don't know personally i would know if it is genuine let me think about it because i know that personally i'm not i don't give the good boy vibe i know that i give the fuck boy vibe mm -hmm. so thinking about it is normal when it comes to me but now i don't know personally i know how to tell if there are other people in her life and mm -hmm. she's really thinking about it but if i think the other people in her life fuck it i may even if you want you to that's a code i will tell you don't think about it i even love you to think about it now I, I want me because i will never come back how many sisters do you have? Hmm? How many sisters do you have? So, how many friends that females do you have? He will lot. He will lot. No wonder. A lot. <laughs> no wonder. I think that's all that has a lot of female around him, and that's that. That's very obvious. The third question is: Does sleeping with her on the first date <laughs> mean she is cheap? On the first date. Yeah. Maybe you guys just go to the club. You guys, you guys are just done nothing. There's a bed involved. Like I said, no. For fire, she just <laughs> she fell for the trips. Oh, it's normal. Oh it's normal. See, <laughs> give me fat guy my <laughs> No, you know what? I don't know how a lot of pussy girls, so, but I, I know myself. You know what I'm you want. Sweet, I, I'm a sweet boy. All right. I'm a sweet boy. There's no how you but want. Keep it your game. You know what? Exactly. So right. if you want to, do we have this face? No, do we have this face? No, 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 no. Right. It's not like that. But normal is normal. You might want to. Mm. Does not mean she's cheap. She like see. I, I, there are statements I eat now. I've heard a whole lot of boys say statements like, Now, now, granota, you say, for calm now, shower ma, shower ma, now, this one. See, if a girl likes you, she likes you, she won't stress you. See, there are a lot of boys out there that you are talking about shower ma, talking about grand, you're talking about this and that. Guy, they are ready to give her millions of men, ready to give her a lot, yeah, and she will collect it and they will not see draw. They will not see one or two. They will. They, they might never even get to Oga. Is that bad? But she sees you, 
and because you invite her to our, your house, you invite her to your house rather, and she comes, you you offer her barely a drink or so, and you had sex, and you now feel that's why she did it. No, definitely not. Obviously not. She liked you. But there are girls that some girls will say, "Oh, you want to sleep with me? Buy me shawarma. You want to sleep with me? Buy me hair." What Those do kind do? of buy things. Me. Eh, buy me shawarma. See now, if you want to, then you say you want to sleep with me. It can't be that cheap. See, Tara, believe me. <laughs> if it is that cheap, you have to look at the value of girl you are going for. All oh, right. If sure. you are going for a girl that is naturally, when I say cheap, when I mean okay, a girl that is that's a very expensive phone, very expensive air. She tells you to buy me shawarma. She likes you. There's no, there's no cap about it. She likes you. Uh -huh. She just wants to make it look like you pay the price. She likes right. you. But a girl that naturally she cannot even afford the basic necessities of life, I and she tell you buy shawarma. Like, okay, she might, it might that might be a price. Okay. But when it comes to things like she's an expensive babe, or she can afford those okay. things you are trying to buy for her, that she tells you to buy for her, she likes you. She's just, she's just looking for a price. Probably she, is that's how her brain is built out. Don't do it for free. But okay. she's looking for a price. Okay. So that being said, you guys have heard that. I think not that of all guys or person see anything I see is personal. So no. I, I, on behalf of all guys, I will say I will give an advice. I know not all boys think like this, but I'll give an advice. No all girls that have sex with you on the first date is cheap. Okay. Some might be. I won't say not. Some might be. Mm -hmm. But say if she's not Billy that okay, it is not Uko. It is not she's not a prostitute. Come on, she's not cheap, she likes you. So okay, being a guy if in a relationship is actually okay. Hmm? Being a guy in a relationship is actually okay. Explain. Like you are, you, are, you are with somebody, you are with a guy and then you're like, Okay, get me hair. I need I need hair, I need to change my wardrobe, all this kind of thing. It's okay now. It's okay, Abby. If you can afford it, never go. I will say once, never go beyond your means for anybody. Okay. For any girl but, in this but life. Okay, because some guys will start saying she's a gold digger. Gold no, she's digger, not. Gold digger. Gold digger. Gold digger. I believe okay, something. Uh, I uh, yes, they are gold diggers. Let's let's. They are people that I understand patterns and I under, I understand when when I see something that is a red flag. E.g., because you know I might like you. Hmm? If you know I like you. Personally, I spend on both my male friends, my female friends. If I have the money, okay. I spend the whole lot. I be, I be what you call lavish spender. I don't know how to even save. I spend okay. a lot. But then, if you're an, if you're a stranger, I can spend on you. Mm -hmm. But if I like you, I find it hard to spend on you. Why? Especially if you know I like you. Yes. Because I I will say I have this fear. The people get me screaming. No, 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 no. <laughs> it's a girl scream because it is it is it's like it is it's like this. If especially if I know that you know I like you. I maybe not because I know a lot of I have a lot of female friends or I know a lot of girls. It scares me to think that she's trying to take advantage of the fact that I like her. Okay. If I did not like you, you are just my friend. I can spend even a net on you. Because you are my friend. You don't even need to be my friend. You are around me. Everybody around me has to be happy. But once I know you, you know I like you. I, I will find it very difficult to spend on you until, okay, I'm sure, 100% sure that the like is mutual. Well, you know one thing I find very amusing, guys, is that you meet a girl, she's, her hair is like on fleek, her nails on fleek, mm. her phone is on fleek, and then you are dating this girl and you don't expect her to ask for something of that level. See, sure, I'll say this way. Everybody, don't go um, above your means. Finally, somebody said it. I'm happy that there is a guy. I'm happy that there's a guy that said this. See, I said before, date within your range. When this girl stuff was when we're trending, I mean, was trending rather, this caramel sugar and her friend stuff, and the girl said that if you send 10k, she would. I mean, wait, 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 the least you can do is actually appreciate the person. Thank you for this money. Yeah. But if you're in a relationship with that person, look at that person you are sending that money to. Okay. What will you do in this person's life? Let's not even lie to ourselves. Okay. So that's within your range. That was, I, I was saying that and everybody was like, I'm, I'm supporting. I'm not supporting anybody. It's just the truth. See, it is like this. When I say this within your range, you are, you are, already, you are already twisting my word. I don't like it. I really don't like it. <laughs> it is true? simple. It is simple. When I say this between your means, how much can you afford? You see a girl. Hmm? 
you like this girl mm -hmm. in this life as a man i'm i i will tell you 100 percent as a man i believe you should work freaking hard so as a man you see this girl you like her if, if you cannot afford her at that time calm down no stress work hard if she's available when you can you afford can her afford her fair enough if she's not i bet you there's always another girl better that is thing. better or like her so date within what you can afford yeah. see and i also advise date rich girls oh. date rich girls date rich girls girls that will motivate you because when i say date within your means because you are broke you date girls that are broke come on you won't be motivated to work out so mm -hmm. date which which date which girls that the fact know. that she has a whole lot of money you want to work out so you can impress her i've actually dated someone that had more money than i i did like she had ah, that girl came on. jesus she came on. but i used to feel embarrassed in my oh. life like god oh, let the broke girls breathe ah she's love it no 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 she had a whole lot of money like I used to, in my mind, I used to try, like, okay, she can send that money. And she would send it back. I'm like, ah, oh, shit. Yeah. Wow, wow, wow. <laughs> wow, wow, wow. You so bad. <laughs> she mostly does the sending. Yeah. But then, she made me see life in another aspect. Like, guy, you have to make it in this life. Yeah. Because I, if you like the girl, I definitely. I do all this one. I say, she's a good girl. You are lying to yourself. You don't like her. Yeah. Because if you like someone, whether yeah, it is. Where his heart is. Exactly. See, whether it is your friends. This guy is your friends your girlfriend your mother your father if you like someone you naturally want them to be happy it might not be money but whatever you can do to make them happy some people don't might not want money but then you want to take them to places that you know will make them happy like mm -hmm. take them to movies take them mm -hmm. to go and play game mm -hmm. the that, any mom. Yeah. why do we take our friends like our party our male friends we mm -hmm. tell them i'm gonna go drink because you know my friend me and my party we like to get high mm -hmm. so it is because you like them if you like someone definitely if you know this girl likes money and you like the girl definitely you spend on her now next question is do guys like girls that have seen it and really have said their bullshit their bullshit <sighs> oh god this thing is i will say it is the personal question it's not for everybody personally i don't like girls that said bullshit girls like that see that's a personal thing i like strong girls i like girls that i'll tell you no you, you won't do that exactly no. because when you it feels like you're just kissing us it's, it's it makes me feel you're obsessive it makes you feel you don't know what you want so i i get irritated by such things that's personal and there are some boys that when they want when they say this i have a friend a very close friend of mine he will tell you that guy if i tell my babe this it is this and she cannot say no she has to conform herself to this. There are boys like that. Yeah, so that is the conqueror is there. <laughs> no, I, I, I'm not afraid of that, my friend. He's one of my sweetest. When I say he's a sweet boy, like, when I say he's a sweet boy, to girls who is a sweet boy, like, but he's a person of his person. Like, if I tell her this, it has to be this. She cannot accept as that. Yes, there's this, this elderly there. friend of mine. I asked him this question a long time ago, actually, when I first thought about it. And the guy told me that. Just say this way. If you, if you have a guy that always tells you do this, you do it. Do this, you do this. Do this, you do this. Do you feel like he will be able to trust you with life decisions of your marriage, your relationship? Because you don't have a mind of your own. Ah. Mm. Well, like I said, <laughs> it is personal. I like powerful girls. Yeah. I like powerful girls. That's why I want to marry someone that is educated. Spiritual, you must be. I don't know the kind, the kind of religion you are, but you must be spiritually strong. Mm -hmm. You must have be strong on your own. Yeah. Because I cannot, I can't, it is simple. I can't imagine someone being the mother of my children and she does not have a mind of her own. Her. <laughs> what if I die? Let's just imagine. I don't pray to die young, but what if I die? Who would take care? Who would? You can't be strong enough to lead my children right Mama, now. Mama, give on. this man on. one, one crate of stuff on the house. <laughs> <laughs> no, but really, really, I, I, I like strong girls. Personally, it is not personal is it personal or something i can't say it it's, it's for everybody does accepting a guy back after a cheat lower your standard <laughs> how many times should you accept a guy back before before you, before you <laughs> let him go eventually say, I'm not <laughs> i'll just tell you something what you are foolish <laughs> to accept anybody back depending on why if you cheated and you accept back you are very foolish i will tell you something there eh? Nobody is ever sorry. 
why do you think that okay i was cheating i was cheating on you i was cheating on you, was cheating on you. until you caught me i was never sorry it's because you caught me and what will make you catch me you now left me and you took me back it makes me understand that you have value no it doesn't mean you don't have value it just means that you always take, you always take my bullshit you always take it that means you are very foolish i will i will continue cheating and my next time not allow you catch me but it just it's just fact that i'll continue you i cheated on you you broke up with me then you now are setting back ah oh, come on <laughs> i know that i know that it's, it's hard for you to live without me so come on i can do whatever i please i know that if you catch me again i won't allow you catch me but if you catch me again it might take time but you will still accept me back it's normal so that's just it don't don't be foolish enough i'll tell i tell my male friends you catch your girl cheating it's over don't be foolish it's over if you catch anybody cheating it's over you know rate your papa see you know one thing actually boys a boy can love you and cheat on you but at least you should date someone smart enough for you for him not to allow you catch him it should be that smart like ne- it should never allow you catch him i can't I can, there's okay apart, apart from one there's none of my eggs i can say i caught him it's not possible it's not possible you can't catch me you can't you it's not possible because i if i would date someone i like you i like you a lot and i would not disrespect you enough to allow you catch me that is it you can't catch me i can't be in short fact no this are no peace all men are cheating your boyfriend is cheating everybody's cheating on you your boyfriend is freaking cheating but now is he smart enough for you to catch him is if you cannot catch him that means he loves you <laughs> yes your boyfriend is cheating you are all cheating is it of odds against this video back to send that email okay so back to what you were saying and um, so as i was right, saying that's everybody's cheating your boyfriend is cheating on you you know all uh, that for the first time i disagree with you because i believe that <laughs> i don't know i believe that once a cheat i mean once a cheat never a cheat Never. Yeah. I, like I feel like once you cheat once, it's not emotional you always cheat again. <laughs> I don't know why I believe that, but I just believe that. Yeah. <laughs> just my thinking that see, it's not always. We, 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 we see, there's always someone that brings that. No, thing. no, I just. Has anybody ever cheated on you? Oh my god! Oh, 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 so, hello, hello, hello! So many people. So many people. <laughs> and which of them are you forgiving? No. No. Yes, no. That's smart. No, no, that's a smart thing to do. Don't have to forgive anybody. But. Whoever has twisted your mind that, that made you believe that if I have cheated before, there's nothing I'll cheat again. Shout out to that guy. God bless you. You are done. No, you are done. 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 You would you do it? And all of them kept saying no, no, no. See, let me Some tell you people won't do it. Like I'll, that I'll tell you something. Personally, mm-hmm. like I said, if if I was not caught, mm-hmm. you keep on doing it. I won't. I would never. I won't stop. Like I said, apart from one, none has ever caught me. The only one. See, now I don't have feelings for again. But if I had the chance to do it again, like, can I replay it and? I wish I never even did it in the first place. But do you even, do you, I will want to understand something. If she forgave me after I cheated and, oh, this is sad, I'm feeling sad now. Mm. If she forgave me after I cheated and we're back together, it might have ended, it might still be together. When she cheated, I'll cheat again. I'll just never get caught again. But now, I only feel that pain. I only feel that regret because I currently don't have her again. I currently feel I I ought to I liked. But it is what it is. Ah, it's been far day on my shoulder I've thought about this. But then, definitely, if you are caught, if you forgive the person, the person will do it, it again. again. Don't forgive. That's why I have this policy that if I catch it, that's the end. Exactly. See, am I, Actually, is your boyfriend going to cheat? Yes. Would you catch him? If you catch him, is that is not smart enough or he does not like it? 
No, that's it. I used to say that it should be smart enough for me not to catch him. Period. Because if I liked you. <laughs> but don't cheat on me because I'll break up with you. You will not catch him. I'm You will not catch him. Don't you? You will not catch him. You will not catch him. If he likes you, you won't catch him. You will be that smart. You can't. You can't catch him. Like why you catch him? But one day, you that are cheating. One day, you Mister Killing go and leave that shit. I should be sit. I should break up with you. Why? Well, see, why are you? What are you looking for? Me? Is for me. See, everybody flirts. See, forget. I might not even be cheating. Everybody, and I will still flirt online. Like, don't you flirt? Which kind of man? Like, lie that you don't flirt. I don't. Don't. Mm -mm. Your life is boring. A guy, how will you Come know here, that? Come here, God, God, How will you know your life? How will you know that you are still that? You are still that, you don't. When I go out, I see people, hello, hello, hello. <laughs> no, uh, okay, now it's for girls, but boys, we don't notice when one uh -uh. people look at us. See, I have to know that I'm still that. You know, I have to know that I'm still, I still got it. Like, I see, I can like this girl. See, there are a lot of girls that I flirt with, and I, I deep down inside my heart, I know I have zero intentions to watch it. No, and I'll just no. flirt. Just know that I can still do it, John. Come on, you see how that game. So if you see that kind of chat and say I'm cheating, ah, but you can't even catch it, dude. For like the first I said, time, I am really that speechless. Uh -huh. I am speechless. Yeah. The hell? You guys really have audacity. Audacity, okay? Ha! <laughs> I made a statement that I could know you are cheating. I'm not even saying anything about it. But I'll let you like, not like I would say actually like, okay, I know you are cheating. I'll just give you some tips that I know what is happening. But I won't like this thing will not disturb my peace. Do you get there's some girls like that actually? So what did you say that what, what happened? <laughs> Definitely I'll respect you. Now, I'll respect you and I believe you know that I love you. Okay, that so what, so, that's so you won't think see you I won't think that she's cheating on you too. No. You no. just feel like this person doesn't have energy for the shit. No. I want to love if I act, if I'm in a relationship, I want to love you to the extent that you know that I love you regardless. So now for you to know that I'm cheating, mm -hmm. I believe and you're not naggy about it, you're not all dramatic about it. And you know that I'm trying to hide it. It's not as if I did it to your face. I'm trying to hide it. And you still know. And you're not naggy about it. I respect you because you know I love you. Literally, I'll believe. I'll be scared. I'll I'll respect and be scared. That's it. My brother said, he said, oh, no, I'll be scared of her. I'll, <laughs> I'll, be, scared. I'll, I'll be scared because what is giving you that confidence? My brother will give you. No, I believe it takes a whole lot of confidence for you to believe that whoever I'm cheating with cannot steal me from you. Like, what is giving you that confidence? <laughs> I will start suspecting of witchcraft, <laughs> of <laughs> jazz. <laughs> I will sit that down and tell you, okay, I know that you have cash. Me. Yeah, it's okay. It's okay. <laughs> See, no, I will, I will not do that because I believe that is your trap. Uh, you want me to come and confess so you can kill me. I don't, I don't and I, 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 it will be hard for me to I eat swear to what God. you cook. I, swear, I don't want you to confess. Just, just, just leave me. I will stop. Continue. I will stop cheating. Don't Take worry. Enjoy yourself, man. I would, I would, I will stop cheating. <laughs> just that I'm not eating whatever you cook again. <laughs> I'll find ways to, to to make sure that I stop loving you and can end it because it is scary. It's actually very scary. But how do you know I'm cheating? And you don't yes, know. activate your wicked the, the wicked. Like you, 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 you don't know. Now. See if if I'm cheating and you give the attitude. Now there's that attitude you give that now. You can't just leave, you can't do without me. But then attitude you give and now, yeah. <laughs> You have messed up. Run for your life. But for but as a lady, if you have a girl that like that in your life, I'll tell you firsthand. Two things is it will happen. That she's gradually withdrawing from you emotionally. That one day she'll come and tell you that I'm not interested. Or I run. I knew it. it's run. 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 It is not safe run. to stay. Why you like stay? Ah, because ah. They never see you call me. Jojo, you must see you call me. I can't afford to die. Yeah. <laughs> I can't afford to die. The next question is why does the energy die after a while? The relationship thing, the sending of okay, the I love you, love you, the messages, and then all of a sudden just about to reality that okay, we're dating fine, that's good. Nice. Why? And does that mean that it's over you once that thing happens? Hmm. The fact that I've asked a guy this question once, I want to hear your reply by say what the guy told me. A very deep question. Why does it die? I don't have a definite answer for this. Because honestly, I can still love you. It's not as if the energy dies. Chase is just over. 
Okay. Similar. I I was before you said yes, I would choose. Ah, no matter I won't choose. Mm -hmm. Personally, I won't choose. But I will naturally, if you want someone, you want the person to want you, but mm -hmm. you have to present yourself as one thing. Yeah. So you have done that. And now at the beginning it's still a shaky. But now you are used to it. See, eh? there are some kind of food that you have not eaten before and you have been dreaming of eating. Mm -hmm. And the first time you want to eat that kind of food, mm -hmm. you are excited. Mm -hmm. The second time you are excited, third time you are excited. But when the food becomes a regular meal, that's it's just what, normal. It's not as if you don't like it. it's not as if you don't like the food again. Yeah. But it's it's nothing there's nothing exciting. That's why about that's why it. she spice up Probably. spice up the the guy told me something that ladies are programmed to be multitaskers. Like, you guys know how to be in a relationship and still have your life going behind. Everything is okay. Now, guys are not programmed that way. Once they want a relationship with a girl, the first few months they are giving everything, living their normal, like normal routines, and just facing that relationship, facing the girl. After a while, they're like, okay, the girl is mine. She's mine. She's there. She's mine. Now let me go back. To my normal way of routine of life. Uh, these statements you made, I've not thought of life in that state. In that state, in that. Well, the guy that told me this uh, thinking of it, it is true. <laughs> like I just realized, like yeah, I might be, I might be after this girl, and all of a sudden, after okay, I've gotten this girl, and I know that yes, I've gotten this she girl. She knows I love her, and I we know we love each other. No, my I life. Just like, okay, my life, my life. Okay, I am. I am I'm in life. <laughs> Yeah, I get that. That is that's very true. It is true. Okay, so that is said to girls. After the honeymoon phase, that's the one that does not love you. Okay, I will stop love being you. dramatic. We love you okay? a lot. <laughs> Just make us realize that. Yeah. Guy, I can't see that love again. Remind us. Oh, and we'll, we'll when, pause again. Yeah, yeah. We'll yeah just yeah, give I you some again and go back. <laughs> yeah. Just All right. Now, um, the this one just popped up in my head. I saw it on Twitter that the way you, for example, when you, when you meet a guy the first time and it's like okay. Tell me, tell me about your past that you're like, oh, my, my ex boyfriend did this to me, he's a bad person. That thing makes guys feel like, okay, this guy doesn't really deserve more. But when you tell him, oh, my ex guy was a very good person, what broke up for, and broke us up was mutual actually. He gave me his baby girl treatment, but we just had to break up. That way, the guy feels like, okay, I need to. I'll tell you something. As I would advise boys that they never ask about my ex. Don't do don't do it's it. Not my, it's not my. It's, it's not my business. It's, 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 but, uh, it's not because of it's a. It's a. It's a. It's a. People I say is a shit. People I say. People I say. Ah. <laughs> I'm married to my sister. Two seconds. Ah. Uh, yes, <laughs> actually, I'm don't worry. But it's after it's I don't the, cheat. Leave the don't past cheat. in the past. Don't really, ask about it. Really, I know. I now advise you if a girl, if you meet a girl, you did not ask about her ex, and she keeps telling you about her ex. Leave her. Leave her. She still. She still. She still has something for her ex. Oh. Don't let a girl. <laughs> Present a standard for you. Mm -hmm. Be the stand. Do be a new standard. Don't let her tell you. you my ex did this. this. My ex did that. I Come on, that's your ex. I'm not your ex. Oh, the funny part I said, but I, like I, I say it every it time. Leave the past in the past. Is it a past? It's a past for a reason. Leave it there. Nobody cares. It is the future. <laughs> not all the past you live in. The past. It's all the past you live in it's the past. It's okay, for example, oil. like what do do you say? What uh, what what past can you not live in? Yes, past? which past can you not live in? Body count. Why are you telling your body? I feel like it's rude to ask for your body count. I feel like it's extremely rude. Don't do that. Uh, body count. You still um, can't say body count. <laughs> um, financial status. You need to know because you need to know how hard you need to work. What else? I'll say those two things. I might be thinking of you. I might tell. I might hello, say it later. Hello, body count is out of it. Don't say your body count. What's, what, what's your business? Okay, she tells that my body count is 10. What difference does it change? What does it change now? <laughs> what, does it, what does it change? <laughs> See, personally. Eh? Personally. Eh? Personally. Eh? I'll say this and I'll say this. Eh, I'll say no this and no peace. Eh? I can't date a girl that has, has a body count of 10. How many is your body count? See, okay, like man, Abby, go ahead. Exactly, I, mean, I, mean, I want to, I mean, to, I mean, to understand that yeah, never yeah, yeah. in your life Jesus. compare it. Never See, compare it. Hello, my body count is so much that I can't remember, and I can say it anywhere, even in front of my friends. You know why? I'm a man, yeah. but as a woman, can you say such a thing? Society defines us, let's understand that. It's not right to eat any other person. A boy eat a girl, a girl eat a boy, but if a girl eats a boy, 
in public. Nobody sees as a big deal. But if a boy eats a girl in public, definitely is a big deal. You are you are less of a man. That is how society has painted it. Now that is the same thing as body counts. Now, if a girl has a whole lot of body count, mm. she is freaking cheap. Guy, why would I want to be the girl? Why would I want to be the guy that ev- with, that is with the girl that everybody can have? Ex- like really? There's this. Like, I also to understand this, something. This channel, they just stand. Mm. She she made a statement in one of these videos with her husband, mm. and it says that if a girl has a body count like ten, if he does not care, he said it because he why? No, he said because. What if this girl had been in a relationship that did not pass two months, three months, four months, and that, and that what led to the 10, yeah. ten body counts, right? Yeah. I want to explain something to you. What is wrong with you? See, if you're in, if you, I, I can permit a body count of five. It depends on your age, though. But at my age, I can permit anybody I would date to be at most three years older or three years younger. I can permit a body count that is that is up to five because I don't believe you should have dated that whole lot at this age range. Now, what is making you why have you dated 10 people? 10 relationships did not work. 10, there's something wrong with you. There's definitely something wrong with you. For the first time, the second time, it is not one person. Time, it's I not am, two people, it's I not am, three people. I am speechless. Guys, if you know me, you know I know how to argue. So no, I have so much in my head, but I don't know how to argue. Listen, I personally feel like this body counts thing. Leave it where it stays. See, let's ex- let me understand something. Let me see. It is something that hurts. See, I wish it was not like that. Because personally, I don't see it as I I would tell that sex is just sex. Sex is sex. But now, I want to understand something. As a girl, hmm, psychology says that girls want boys that other girls want. Do you know that? Naturally. <laughs> Even if I'm not in a relationship, if I like this girl and she asks me, do you have a girlfriend? I'll say yes. Because now she wants you because definitely you are wantable. Girls want what other girls want. And now, but do you, and now if you present yourself as a boy that I'm this boy, a lot of girls want me. I have a lot of girls. Other girls want you. Hello. Why do you think girls like bad boys? There's not. I don't like Calm bad down. boys. There's nothing you tell me, but body count stays in the past. Wait. I don't care. Of course. Now let me now, let me let me let me let me give you this statement. Why would I want to be with a girl that has slept with ten boys? There's, I'm even giving. I'm giving it at a at the body count of ten. That is the point at which I will say I can't do it. Below ten. Below f- five is my point, but above five, you can still, you can, we can, we can imagine it to be the past, but above ten, ten and above now, and now you have ten, ten boys have had access, access. See, that means you are easy. Is see, you might have been in love. I'm not saying you are cheap. You see, it's not as if no, you are, you are a prostitute. Why are you talking about me? No, no, I mean like, I'm, I mean as a female gender. No. No, no, no. I mean, as a female gender, you might, the girl might have been in love. But you fall in love that easy. Is your heart that easy to assess? You have been in 10 relationships in that same age bracket. If you fall under this category, uh, um, uh, come yeah, on. There's nobody shaming to you. See, I'm, it's see, okay. I'm not shaming you. It's okay. You are fine. Jesus will heal you. Jesus will heal you. But for me, don't let me know. I would. I can't. I can't do it. This man be moving mad. Yes. So I, I, you know say I'm I've said I've said this thing. I've said I've said this thing. 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 That the system is built against women. No. No. It is built against no, women. No. 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 There is a particular clip I will start when I when I'm talking about sexually. When, sexually. When when when. 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 Hold on. Probably. Hold on. Hold on. There is this clip I will start when I'm talking about. I, I hope I find that find this clip of in the olden days. The kind of punishment women were given for things. If you put the punishment for men and the punishment for, for women, you be like it comes to adultery. Oh my god. Things like adultery. Adultery, stealing, you know, I'm like, what? So guys, the forces against these videos, <laughs> this video rather, they are plenty. Our camera, everything went off again. And you want to say something? <laughs> I would I would like to she told me to apologize yeah. to those that I have body counts more than 10. Well, I'm not sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry that I'm not sorry, bro. You'll be fine. Do you you are good. There's nothing bad about it. Yeah. See, I'll, I'll say something. I'm not a good person. I want everybody to understand this. That personally, I'm a bad person. So, what I think is because I'm a bad person. 
So it's not as if there's anything wrong with you. It's just what I won't take. But so, it is fine. You are a fine what person. What he's trying to say is that you are not bad. trying to insult you at at all, at all. your body, your choice. At right? It's your choice. So. It's your choice. <laughs> but for him, it is a no, a no for me, but it is your choice. I respect it. Okay. I respect You're not helping. <laughs> Let me say this again. Guys, please, if this whole situation is you, don't feel bad about it. I understand that at times the men outside can be moving mad. You understand? So please do this. Ah. Okay. But seriously, we are very sorry. But no, it's not me. You are very sorry. <laughs> Please don't feel bad. Don't feel body shame. He's just trying to tell you that he can't do it. Ah, body shame, okay. Ah, no. No. Ah, no. Did you get? Please. He's just trying to tell you that he can't. Just what I don't like. He can't be with a girl that has ten body count. He can't do it. Sorry. Sorry. No. Oh, your lips. Oh, your lips. I'm sorry. I'm very sorry. Did you get? He's not body shaming you at all. He's just trying to tell you that his own taste is a no. No, no. And this is what I'm thinking for all the other guys. There are guys that don't. There are boys care. that are like nasty girls. Hey now, we have not said to tell people you are nasty. Help me get a Ramo call. Let me grab this for a for me. No, I'm it. Okay, sorry. I'm not speechless. Sorry, sorry. Okay, so with that being said, the last question, which is my own personal question, is that, although you've answered it already, but do all men cheat? Yes. You, you are cheating. Your boyfriend is cheating. Everybody, everybody is cheating. Oh, do all men cheat? Mm. No, not all men. Most men. I have a friend. Shout out to Olami Likwa Jomari. I will say it because his yeah, girlfriend. I'm proud. I'm not proud of him. He's a foolish boy. Um, his girlfriend might watch this video. And I, I want that to know. Your boyfriend is is one of the most loyal people I've met in this life. He does not cheat. No matter what, he won't cheat. No matter how much the green light is, he would not cheat. He can flirt. You can flirt, you can flirt with the girl, but yeah, you will never cheat. Flirting is a lot. I feel like flirting is a lot because I feel like you're a fine guy. Yeah, but you will never I cheat. Would, I would, I would lie to myself about it that I'm dating a fine person. And if we get admired, I would lie to myself exactly. about it. But then you should have said, does he have a brother? Yeah, he has a brother. His brother is a fuck boy. Okay, no. <laughs> <laughs> come on, come on, I don't cheat now. Hello, oh, hello, 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 please, no go. Don't, don't, don't try it, don't try it. My sister is a no, no. Ah, stop it, stop it. You want Ola Mille cause causing. It's because that no shit. Ah, you see, Ola Mille is a weird woman. I don't know how he existed. All his friends cheat. No, I not all his friends. I'm his friend and I don't cheat. I don't cheat. I will tell you where he said the part that he cheats. Okay, so that okay. Be... But you can never catch me. Uh, so I'll never break <laughs> So I literally, you are not, you are, it's not cheating once you get caught, mm -hmm. but how liquid is like that? That, at first I said all men cheat, but I just realized that I have that one friend that he won't, he will tell you that. You're lucky, what's his baby name? Funke. Funke, you're lucky. I'm happy for you, you're really, you're really lucky. If you're done with him, you can let me know so I can give it to my sister. Yeah. Don't worry, this video has been, you guys, I wish you had seen the behind the scenes. We had a lot of conversation about our life and I'm like, this boy is an alpha male. Alpha? No, 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 no I'm not alpha. You no, I'm are, just, I'm just. If you feel like he is, let me in the comment section. Now, just go ready for this combat because you'll be a feminist beside him and I'm going to have a conversation. <laughs> and I want you guys to go ready for that bad boy. Because me, I'm sorry, I'm back up all the old ladies. I'm sorry I, I could not defend you guys really well. I'm not good at arguing. I said a lot that I run it from arguments and confrontation. I don't like it. Mm -hmm. What I've said, I've said that that's it. So it's on you to take your own thing. You get it. <laughs> but don't worry, there's a girl that's coming. So come and do the good that I did not do. Please. <laughs> can some, can some, can some, can some, can Adios. <laughs> so to be seen in our next video, let me know your opinions about the things that were said. If you agree with him, if you don't agree with him, just don't say so till we'll see in our next video, please subscribe, leave a comment down below, do the nice video for YouTube things. I'm your favorite girl, Naya Ovili. Thank you for coming on my channel. You're welcome. Thank you for giving the unfiltered truth about life. Guys, your girl was put in a hot seat today. But till we'll see in our next video, when you see his face again, people should get ready. Get ready for the battle. The battle. <laughs> the battle. <laughs> <laughs> oh my. Bye.